Wow, a sponsor ad? Yeah, that's right. Protect your devices with Surfshack antivirus and VPN right away. We got promo code down in the description below. Stay Hello guys, I'm back again with another video because I saw some noise in the comments when I was recording uh, Callisto Protocol in that video. Uh, one person had a problem, he couldn't set his fan curve speed on uh, Intel R control panel, so uh, I decided to check what's going on, because previously, uh, on previous drivers, I still had the option to control it, so uh, yeah, let me open up here, go to performance, as you can see, fan speed uh, is there to monitor, everything is set to on, it should be there, so uh, yeah, everything is like it was before, I unticked, it ticked, then I went to configure and uh, yeah I saw there's no option for fan curve which was super weird uh, then I went around check if there's maybe any secret setting in the control panel but uh, yeah no to no avail so here's the solution what you need to do to enable the fan curve uh, what you do is go up here to my computer you click this go to C program files Intel, Intel R control, resources, JC, JavaScript, and click on then pages. Once you click on pages, click on this uh, performance. As you can see, we have here performance tuning. So what you need to do is click on edit, then scroll down to the line 111, and uh, you will see there. Let me find it here up quite quickly. It's 111. You have this visible. Just uh, comment out everything uh, and write what is below, so true with comma. So just delete this or uh, and write visible true comma and save the file. Then you should be able to control the fan curve speed in Interarc control panel. But uh, yeah, there might be a problem. I advise you to... Uh, either shut down go to the task manager and shut down the uh, intel arc control panel just like i did here in the video and uh, then there should uh, be an option in performance settings once you open up again intel arc control panel you will go here to performance configure let's check configure click jump. And uh, yeah, you can see now we have an option, fan speed control, and we can set it to fix fan target or fan curve. So uh, yeah, but here I had a problem because when I pressed apply, I needed to restart the computer. So if you get this problem, just restart the computer and uh, you won't have any problem setting the fan curve speed. Uh, I will just show you quickly in the video. I will restart here the computer a little bit and uh, you will see how this works. See if we go now back here, we're back again, click apply, fan curve is now set, there's no error, and uh, yeah, that should be it. Let me just quickly now record uh, from my phone to see, to show you that uh, this uh, setting actually works. So yeah, let me show you right now, let's go. And uh, just to confirm this works, uh, we have here GPU, spinning slow. I put new fan curve, I press apply and let's see what happens. It's slowly spinning it up but uh, only two. What about the three? Huh? It's slowly it's going up as you can see. Started to spin more and more. It just took some time for it to actually register. <laughs> But uh, yeah, that's how you control the fan curve on Intel. There's also the Bifrost app, but that one doesn't work on my end. Maybe because I don't have their GPU. So yeah, this is the way to do it. Everything is working fine. Set your fan curve. Do the overclocking here. Choo, let's go. Uh, I will also post a new video how to overclock with this new tool. I will show you just right now. I found it. It's called the arc tool and once you go here you have this overclocking uh, settings you want the power limits temperature leave with offset or voltage so yeah i will play around with this a bit more and make another video for you guys to 
overclock your Intel Arc GPUs without the use of Intel Arc control panel but uh, for fan speeds for now this is the only way to make it work so yeah enjoy set your fan curve don't let it overheat and uh, see ya in the next video